Hello, it's transplanting pepper day again. Um, I'm dividing up the peppers. I start with two seeds per cell and uh, it guarantees me that I have one per cell uh, in case some don't germinate. And in this case you could see I have um, a nice big one here and a little baby one there. And this one had fair shot to come up and one of two things happened. Either I planted the seed too deep or it's just a weak seed. In either case you're going to want to remove this and as you can see there's not much root there it's like not even really there so this is one you don't want to keep because it's just gonna waste space in your garden and it's not going to be much of a producer and you don't need to feel guilty about doing that sometimes it it is hard in the beginning I used to have a hard time thinning out and and weeding out and like oh my gosh I'm killing a plant how could I do this but it's better for your garden it's better for you it makes more room for the ones that are going to do well for you and produce well for you so I have more than enough here I don't need all these plants I have plenty to even give away these are hot cherry peppers and I'm only going to probably plant three and uh, I don't know how many are there two four six eight so there's like nine plants there at least um i think even more it's hard to judge with this but anyway um my pepper station here with this nice grow light i bought is uh pretty amazing it's only one t5 bulb and the peppers really love it i transplanted these last week and all i did was put some uh the kelp worm casting uh, lobster food in here and they're very happy and this weekend I'm going to start the fertilizing with the uh, bat guano in the water that's how I'm going to start watering them in once a week with that and really get them going and good and strong they're very nicely colored nice and green they're healthy they're happy but I'm out of room. I have to start my tomatoes and a few other items. And I still have to transplant a bunch of peppers. I have, I don't know, maybe four other types of peppers I still have to transplant. I do have room for those. But we're going to set up another grow station on this wall here. Um, Fred's picking up the lights today. And I ordered the bulbs and the ballasts. And just going to wire it in. And uh, we bought one of those... Um, shelving uh, units, those steel ones from Lowe's for $79. So for less than $200, I could put a four-tier very large grow station where they cost a ton of money in the store uh, to buy them, like $800, $900 in nuts. Um, so that's what we're doing this year, and I uh, hope this was helpful to you. That don't feel guilty about pulling the little ones there. Um, you'll do yourself a favor. Have a great day. Bye.